In other news, one of the suspects in the Wapaka County deer slaying case will likely stand trial this time for taking a man's life. Rory Kunez is uh, charged with the 2004 hit and run death of Kevin McCoy. In the criminal complaint, witnesses say uh, Kunzi was driving drunk when he hit McCoy, who was walking on the side of the road. It goes on to say that he then moved McCoy's body to the ditch. A Wapaka County judge ruled there's enough evidence for Kunzi, as well as one of his friends accused of lying about the incident, to stand trial. Fox 11's Cameron Clark was in court and has the details. Tears from his mother and support from friends as they heard testimony about the night Kevin McCoy died more than five years ago. What did Mr. Kunzi do as you were holding on to the um, shoulder area of uh, this person's clothing? He was holding on to his lower legs. And what happened then? We carried him into the ditch. Where was Mr. Engel when this happened? Standing outside the truck. Adam Klotzbeaker says he was at two underage drinking parties with Rory Kenzie and Walter Engel that night. Klotzbeaker says he was driving behind Kenzie. They heard a loud thump and uh, something white coming from under the truck. He says he then helped Kenzie move the body as Engel stood nearby. Engel, who was riding with Kenzie, told authorities they thought they hit a deer and did not stop. While the defense pointed out Klotzbeaker has changed his story while talking to investigators. This is not the only uh, version of these events that you've told, right? Yes, this is not the only version. Also taking the stand, Deputy Coroner Sharon Soar, who was on the scene and later inspected Kinsey's pickup truck. The large impact upon the vehicle was consistent with the, the victim's injury, injuries, so I concluded that he it was a motor vehicle that... He died of uh, multiple trauma from that. The judge ruled there is enough evidence for both Kinsey and Engel to stand trial. Both men are scheduled to be back in court next month. In Wapaka, Cameron Clark, Fox 11 News. Kenzie is currently in prison on other charges. The charges against him and two other men in the deer slaying case are on hold.